Hey everyone, Wags here from Eagle Dynamics, and welcome to episode 17 of our DCS F18C Hornet Academic Series. In this episode, we're going to take a look at the FPAS, otherwise known as the Flight Performance Advisory System. And this is a great tool for fuel planning and planning out optimal endurance and range. Let's get started. All right, so uh, we're in the cockpit now. We're looking at the left DDI on the support page. And the first thing we'll do is we'll select uh, push button 19, which is the FPAS page. And what we're seeing is a, a pretty confusing mass of data here. So what we'll do is we'll break it down one element at a time. Uh, to start with, we have our current uh, elements up here, and then we have our optimum elements down here. Uh, with the uh, current, we're looking at our current range to 2,000 pounds of fuel remaining, and that's 600 miles. Uh, coming down to make the optimal uh, current range uh, at Mach, that would be 0.61 Mach. And then if we could hold 0.61 Mach at the current altitude, at uh, 2,000 pounds of remaining fuel, we can fly out to a range of 683 miles. Now coming over to endurance of you know, how long we can be flying in terms of time, uh, at our current uh, uh, Mach and altitude, we can be out there for uh, one hour and seven minutes until we have only 2,000 pounds of fuel remaining. But if we fly optimal Mach of 0.46 Mach, we can extend that to uh, one hour and 58 minutes when we get to only 2,000 pounds of fuel remaining. Uh, now also note, if we're below 2,500 pounds of total fuel remaining, uh, the two 2,000 pound uh, title here will go to zero pounds. So meaning that instead of in relation to 2,000 pounds of fuel remaining, it will be in regards to no fuel remaining. Now, moving down, we have our NAV2 functions. And these can be in relation to either a selected TACAN station or waypoint. And once you have one selected, it'll show you the time to that uh, station or waypoint, the fuel remaining when you get to that point, as well as your burn rate of pounds of fuel per nautical mile. Now, coming down to optimum, we have our optimum altitude setting would be 37,000 feet, uh, 361, at a optimum Mach of 0.83. And if we can do that at uh, 2,000 pounds of fuel remaining, we can go 950 miles. Now, coming over to endurance, so let's see how long you want to be on a cap. Uh, the best way to do that would be at an altitude of uh, 29,831 uh, feet at a Mach of 0.64. And if we do that with endurance, we can be out there for two hours and still have 2,000 pounds of fuel remaining. Uh, coming down, we have our climb function. And when this is checked, uh, above the airspeed block on the HUD, it will show your optimal uh, climb airspeed. And then here on our home function, what we can do is we can select the home airfield. And what will happen here is when we have uh, only 2,000 pounds of fuel remaining uh, estimated to get to that airbase, we'll have a master caution uh, come on as well as a home fuel alert sounded. Anyhow, that's a little look at the FPAS page and I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks.